Hey guys, this is Keith from Amp Publishing. Thanks for joining me today. Um, today I'm going to review a brand new piece of software called Bolt Publisher. Now, what Bolt Publisher does is it publishes instant articles to Facebook. Now, instant articles you may have never even heard of. Um, it's a bit of a newer feature on Facebook and it's just not widely known. However, this piece of software is pretty innovative because really no one else has made it easy to use. Okay, so I'm going to show you for an example um, exactly what instant articles is. Okay, so it's it's geared towards posting to Facebook, uh, but it's geared more towards mobile users. Okay, so uh, I'm recording this on a Mac with a piece of software called ScreenFlow, which does not allow me to record from my mobile device uh, because I have an Android. Um, so what I'm going to do, this is going to be a little bit hokey, but I at least want to show you what an instant article looks like on the Facebook feed uh, on my phone, okay? So it sh this should work for, for this purpose, okay? So what you're going to see is I'm actually on the Bolt Publisher page right here, okay? And this is an actual instant article, okay? Now, if I click this article... What you're gonna see is bam now that loaded already okay this is an entire an entire post right here entire article with video down there images opt-in opt-in forms and uh, everything is on the page okay but it loaded instantly now what you're gonna notice if you've ever clicked on a Facebook post on your mobile phone it takes a while right it usually jumps you out to another website or an external website and it takes a long time to load because it has to load all those assets so essentially Facebook um, instant articles is built for it's geared towards mobile and it instantly loads any kind of article or post that you have okay now I'm just gonna jump over here to my desktop real quick and I just want to show you this is from Hootsuite um, they started to use uh, use instant articles and here's what they found now they found they had a 37% increase uh, in reach 22% increase in shares 83% increase in likes and 57% increase in link clicks okay so they definitely had some success but the negative and what I want to show you is uh, what they said was let's go down here right here the setup requires technical expertise and they actually say that they had to get their development development team uh, in to even handle the setup well that's not um, you know that's that's not really a great way to handle things most people don't have that expertise so that's right where bolt publisher comes in okay it takes and simplifies everything um, and basically gives you a little editor for you to create these articles and get them posted to Facebook, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch over to Bolt Publisher and go ahead and walk you through that. Okay, before we get started, I'm just gonna quickly go over the funnel uh, so you know what you're getting here. Um, now there is the front end product, which you're looking at here. Uh, there's a few things that you're not going to have access to, um, and that would be uh, for the pro version only, okay, so which is their first upsell. Um, you can have multiple accounts um, in the pro version. In this version, you can only connect to one Facebook account. Um, you'll have access to uh, hiring a professional writer. Um, that is a pro version uh, feature as well. Um, publication to Apple News is included in the pro version. Um, and the analytics tab is also something that you're going to get into the pro version. Okay, Everything else that I'm going to show you in here is uh, included in the front end product. Now, uh, their next uh, sell, they have a, a white label uh, edition available. Okay, So you can go ahead and, and pick that up uh, for $197 a year. Um, so it'll give you, um, you know, basically full white label rights. Um, and then the last one is actually an agency license. Okay, so you can go ahead and sell this service to your clients. And that's uh, so a one-time $77 fee. Uh, now the front-end product is $37 uh, one-time fee. And the pro version is $67 one-time fee. Okay, so let's go ahead and just jump in here and take a look around at a bit of the dashboard. Um, now, so what you're going to notice is the first thing you're going to want to do is go to your integrations um, and make sure you set up and connect to your Facebook account, okay, which I've already done. And it's going to allow you then to pick which page you want to publish to, okay? Uh, so you can change those out. Now, we also have email integrations because you are allowed to drop opt in forms uh, into these uh, instant articles. Uh, so they have a few uh, different ones to connect to there as well, okay? Now, in your, um, your profile or your accounts, um, it's just some basic information there you're going to be able to set your um, your name uh, avatar uh, your passwords resets and your time zone as well okay um, now also what we have here uh, let's see 
Yeah, users is going to be uh, for the upgrade because that will be included in the, I believe that's going to be the agency and white label um, uh, packages, okay? Now, you also have a calendar. So you can basically connect to your Google Calendar. So anything that you have scheduled out, um, because you can schedule all these posts, will then automatically be pushed to your Google Calendar. Um, also have um, the dashboard. Okay, so let's just go ahead and jump right into the articles, all right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna create a new article. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna create a campaign here first. I've already created one just called demo. Um, so you can add another one here as well if you just wanna keep things um, categorized, all right? So I'll just do demo. Um, now what we can do is put a header image in, okay? All right. I'll do an article based around one of the promotions I've done. So I'll pick this one here for Spin Writer. Uh, I'm gonna give it a title, okay? And we're just gonna call this one um, Spin Writer. And we've got uh, subtitle. So this is going to be uh, a content uh, spinner. And author name will be me. Description, oh, for now, this is me. And you're gonna pick your publication date, okay? So I'm gonna say this is gonna go out on the 28th, 2016, and we'll do that at 11 a.m. Okay, so then we just go ahead and we click save. And what that's gonna do is bring us into basically your article creator. Now, <clears throat> this is where Bull Publisher becomes, uh, takes the tech side out of it. If you just go into Facebook and try to create these instant articles, you actually have to have um, some markup code that you need to know how to use uh, in order to actually publish these articles. So what this is doing is it's taking all of that out so you just have a nice editor to use. So what we'll do is we'll go ahead and add in some information here. So what I'm gonna do is first throw some text uh, down, okay. All right, so we've got that. Go ahead and there, okay, and then I'll put some space in. Now, what you have is you can drop images, video, um, a map for, uh, you know, if you're doing localized um, articles, uh, a pull quote, so it'll just basically put your um, your text in, in quotes. Um, there's a sidebar, there's Instagram, so you can actually just post in Instagram um, posts here, and I'll, I'll do that for you as well. Uh, same thing with Twitter, you can drop any ad banners you have, and opt-in forms, and then just some buttons, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and and drop in a video, I think here. So there's the video, we'll go ahead and edit it. Now you can upload it, you use YouTube or Vimeo. I'm gonna go ahead and choose YouTube and I've pulled a URL here. So we'll go ahead and drop that. And then we'll put in, let's see here, 640 and 360, okay, great. So enable water, okay, so we'll show that in editor. All right, so that's what it's gonna look like right there, okay? So for my next one, I'm gonna go ahead and drop in some more text, and let's see here. Okay, all right, so I've got that. Put a little space in there. Oop. There we go. Okay, and the next thing I want to do is let's put an Instagram. So I went out to Instagram and just basically grabbed a little uh, a little image. Um, so let's take a look and see what that looks like here. So let's see, where's Instagram? There we go. Okay, so now we've dropped in Instagram. So we can go ahead and edit that and just plug in the URL and then just hit show in, in editor. Okay, so that was what I found was right there. Go ahead, give that a little bit of space. And we'll go ahead and there. Okay, and I'm gonna throw in a little bit more text at the end. Okay, so we're good there. Okay, so now uh, what we can do, like I said, you can add uh, an opt-in form or any kind of a button. So I think I'll drop a button here at the bottom, some sort of call to action. Okay, so then you could go ahead and enter the text in. So get your copy today. And then whatever link we want right now, I'm just gonna send it to Google. Okay, and of course we can edit uh, any colors that we want to edit. All right, so right now, uh, actually it's black, I don't like that. Uh, we'll go ahead and just turn it back to blue. Okay, so now we've got our basically our instant articles already created. Um, it's just that simple. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at this. Okay, so now what you're seeing here is uh, when you first preview, it's gonna give you this this uh, URL. Now you can use this URL to just simply plug into any post uh, on Facebook once it's published, okay? So you have to wait, make sure that the actual article is published before you can you can just uh, share this thing out and put it wherever you'd like uh, in Facebook. And what I mean by that is just simply going in and creating a post 
I could simply, uh, if it were published, I could simply just copy and paste that that link into here and then repost it or boost it or do really whatever I want to do with it at that time. But it does have to be published in order to do that. Uh, and of course, uh, you can edit the project from here as well. All right. So what we can do is click on this link. And here we go. Okay, so here's what this looks like. So there's my header image. My uh, text is here, my spin writer. Uh, it's from um, from me, the author, when it's published, and basically the text. Now, of course, I don't want to do some formatting here and make it look a little bit, bit nicer, but for sake of demonstration, uh, I think you get the point here. And there's my button, okay? So now, when this gets published to Facebook, this is going to show up, you know, just like it would on, um, you know, on the mobile device that I showed you earlier, okay? So it's just that simple to uh, to post these articles and get them created. So as you can see, uh, we have just about every you know every element that we really need to create a um, you know a great eye catching. Um, um, article to post, okay, and with the scheduler, it makes it fantastic. You can schedule that that uh, you know that that content out there, uh, you know, as often as you'd like. Now, again, this is pretty new. Uh, this 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 whole instant articles game. So uh, this type of software, it's really you kind of gets you ahead of the game uh, and it gets you start using this thing. You can create awesome looking um, articles, and it's quick on mobile. I mean, that's what it's for, right? It's to, for people to load on mobile. Uh, mobile users are it grows every day. Um, you know, people are looking looking at their mobile phones more than they are their desktops. Um, so you want that content to load quick. There's nothing more annoying than clicking on a Facebook uh, link and it has to load a website and all the ads are popping up and it's just, it's a pain. Uh, this is a great, great way to get posts, articles. I mean, you drop opt-in forms in there. It's it's really, really smart. Um, and I hope you guys take advantage of this. So uh, I'm going to do is I'm going to drop the, uh, the link to go ahead and grab your copy down on the description. Um, so go ahead and pick up your copy today.